Hey everyone, it's Julian at Liquid Fungi and here is the results of our ryeberry testing. So this is the 2% with our normal recipe. As you can see, this is our uh, normal liquid culture. This has the most growth by far. Now we're gonna step over to 2% rye mix with liquid. And you can see there is some growth growing on there. It's just it's really hard to see up there on the top. Um, see if I can get it into a light or something, but it's growing. It's just not growing quite as well as the uh, mix over here on the left that the company uses right now. So we have 2%, 2%. This is 10% right here. 10% uh, grew a little, uh, grew a bit smaller. It grew a lot more compact. So I'm wondering if this is maybe the threshold of maybe when we're adding too much of that rye liquid for, for too much uh, sugar. But uh, here's 15% right here. 15% it starts to get a little bit more cloudy and the uh, the orbs start to get a lot more smaller from the agar slices um, And honestly from here, there's just not as good results and it's more and more cloudy. So I'm wondering if maybe the um, sediment is skewing the test quite a bit and this one uh, Just seemed like it got contaminated. I don't think anything grew in this 25% one um this one right here is looking very uh, dire. It's, nothing's really growing in there. I think the mycelium's really struggling with that amount of sediment and 100% uh, right here. Um, so not doing great either. So honestly, the best results I'm seeing are between like 2% and 10% and maybe even lower than 2% as a concentration might give me results more like this one. I am not sure, but further testing is needed.